when when I when I was a little girl, I wanted to be white. 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 To me, being white meant being better and having more. It meant acceptance. I was taught to say, I don't talk white. 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 I talk right. Subconsciously creating synonymity between white and right in my mind. Everything and everyone around me was white. 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 Was white. White. At one point, I was taught to be colorblind. I was taught that the only race is the human race. Saying and believing this was supposed to somehow make the world see me and my black, black, black skin the same way it saw my peers and their white skin. But it didn't. It didn't stop my peers from asking me if my hair was nappy. Which it did not stop my peers from making jokes about the ghetto where I It didn't stop my peers from making jokes about slavery and black history. And it didn't stop my peers from calling me blacky. Black black blacky. Blacky. Everything and everyone around me if was white. white. Everyone wanted me to believe that the world would see us the same. And if I just dressed, spoke, and behaved a certain way, the colorblind world would accept me for who I am or who I was tra tra trained to be. When I was a little girl, I would not have known that my black, black, black life mattered. I didn't know my black life mattered. No place big enough for holding All the tears you're gonna cry Cause your mama's name